Hey, what is up, everybody? This is Stevie Breach coming to you with the Monday Night Raw live report. We've been sitting through a lot of stuff here. Honestly, uh, nothing really has been dynamite uh, throughout tonight's show, but John Cena's open challenge came down tonight, and he basically came down and said that the people in the back basically said uh, that they you know, were saying, Cena, you don't have to go out there and put the title on the line tonight. You don't have to do the open challenge. You get the I Quit match against Rusev. You don't need to go out there and weaken yourself up on Monday Night Raw before the big show. And Cena, he said, you know what? This is the United States Championship. This is Monday Night Raw. This is the WWE. I have to go out there and I have to defend the championship because I'm standing up for everybody in the back. I'm standing up for everybody that, um, you know, it, it will never have the WWE Championship. The United States Championship might be as high as a lot of people can finally reach uh, to the heights too. So basically, Cena said, you know what? Titles on the line, bring somebody out, we're going to have a match, and this is the way it's going to go down. And the, 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 the person that came out, you know, hey, it wasn't Heath Slater. Heath Slater did get on his Twitter and basically tweet that he was stuck in traffic, and he wanted to make sure that the match hadn't started yet, but the match already had. And Adrian Neville uh, came out to answer uh, the call. Adrian Neville basically setting the WWE on fire, uh, had great matches against Seth Rollins, uh, beat Wade Barrett on the uh, Extreme Rules pre-show, went to the finals of the King of the Rings tournament uh, before losing to Bad News Barrett yet once again, but um, Adrian Neville comes out. Adrian Neville versus John Cena lines up to have a really, really great match. Real fun uh, um, with these two guys meeting up. Both real, real strong. Lots of power from both of these guys, and um, you know, lots of brute strength. You know, the, uh, I like the way Cena basically builds this, these matches around, basically showing off what. Um, you know, these guys bring to the table. Um, it's almost like ECW. Where you hide their weaknesses and you just you know, really build up off of their strengths. And I'm sure right now, Adrian Neville going to the back is getting like probably one of the loudest ovations that he's ever gotten. I'm sure right now it's something that's really earned a lot of uh, Vince McMahon's uh, respect. And um, um, basically, you know, just a damn good match from these guys. This is pay-per-view caliber stuff from something that's going to happen more than likely down the road, uh, if, you know, all the stars align, Adrian Neville becoming a main eventer for WWE, uh, meeting up against a guy like John Cena, this was the pay-per-view caliber match that if you were watching on pay-per-view, you really felt like you got to see something that was really worth your money, and, uh, you know, you, you, you're glad that you ordered a show and able to, to watch this, but uh, we saw both guys going back and forth, back and forth, uh, John Cena hitting the attitude adjustment, Adrian Neville kicking out, um, basically, um, Neville uh, power bombing John Cena down really, really strong out of the corner before setting up to hit his red arrow. Uh, once he did hit the red arrow, looking like it was a guaranteed victory for him. Uh, right there to meet him as he hit the mat was Rusev. As Rusev, um, you know, kicked Neville first. Uh, so Neville's going to be the one who gets the win via disqualification, thanks to Rusev, uh, who beat Neville out of the ring before beating down on a already beaten John Cena. And no doubt in my mind that if Rusev wasn't there, Neville would have been our new United States champion. Maybe now we will see who is going to be feuding with Rusev after uh, payback if John Cena wins. We'll see Rusev. Uh, taking uh, a, a shot going after Neville um, and seeing where they go from there. But it's going to be John Cena against uh, Rusev at uh, Payback in the I Quit match. So, of course, Rusev strats on the accolade onto uh, John Cena, making him, you know, cry like a little girl right there in the middle of the ring and, um, you know, setting up the I Quit match. I think everybody, uh, uh, I don't hear a lot of people talking about this match, honestly, but we'll have to see what happens at Payback this week.